Soyuz 2, Grau Index 14A14, is the collective designation for the 21st century version of the Russian Soyuz rocket. In its basic form, it is a three-stage carrier rocket for placing payloads into low Earth orbit. The first stage boosters and two core stages feature upgraded engines with improved injection systems, compared to the previous versions of the Soyuz. Digital flight control and telemetry systems allow the rocket to be launched from a fixed launch platform, whereas the launch platforms for earlier Soyuz rockets had to be rotated as the rocket could not perform a role to change its heading in flight. Soyuz 2 is often flown with an upper stage, which allows it to lift payloads into higher orbits, such as Molniya and geosynchronous orbits. The upper stage is equipped with independent flight control and telemetry systems from those used in the rest of the rocket. The NPO Lavichkin manufactured frigate is the most commonly used upper stage. Soyuz 2 rockets were first launched from Site 31 at the Baikonur Cosmodrome, and Site 43 at the Plesetsk Cosmodrome. Launch facilities shared with earlier R 7 derived rockets, including the Soyuz U and Molniya. Commercial Soyuz 2 flights are contracted by Starsim, and have launched from Site 31 at Baikonur and ELS, L'Ensemble de Lancement Soyuz, which has been built at the Guiana Space Center on the northern coast of South America. The Soyuz 2 version Street B can deliver 3,250 kg 7 to geostationary transfer orbit from this equatorial site. In 2016 the new Vostokny Cosmodrome started operating Soyuz 2 flights as well, from its first launch pad called Site-1s. The Soyuz 2 has replaced the Molniya M and Soyuz U since 2010 and 2017 respectively, and is taking over the missions of the Soyuz FG which will be retired in 2019 as production of Soyuz 2 ramps up. TSSKB Progress halted production of Soyuz U in April 2015. The final flight of a Soyuz U rocket took place on the 22nd of February 2017, carrying Progress MS05 to the International Space Station. According to CNES officials interviewed in May 2018, launches of Soyuz from Guiana may be replaced by the Ariane 6 medium lift version A62 in 2021. Topic: Variants. <laughs> 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 Soyuz 2 family includes 2.1A, 2.1B and 2.1V. The first two variants are modifications to the Soyuz U launcher. The latter is a light version without side boosters. When launched from the Koru site, Soyuz 2 is always mated with the same type fairing. This version is called Soyuz Street or Soyuz STK, where additional K indicates special measures taken for preparing and launching the rocket in hot and humid conditions. Topic. Soyuz 2, 1A The 2.1A version includes conversion from analog to digital flight control system and upgraded engines on the booster and the first stage with improved injection systems. The new digital flight control and telemetry systems allow the rocket to launch from a fixed rather than angled launch platform and adjust its heading in flight. A digital control system also enables the launch of larger commercial satellites with wider and longer payload fairings such as the Saint type fairing. These fairings introduce too much aerodynamic instability for the old analog system to handle. This stage continues to use the Rode 0110 engine. The 2.1A, Saint version is sometimes called Soyuz Street A. The first launch, from Guiana, 17 December 2011 for Pleiades HR-1AS SOT, ELISA four satellites, was a success. Soyuz 2, 1B The 2.1B version adds an upgraded engine Road with improved performance to the second stage. First launch took place from Plesetsk Cosmodrome Site 43 on 26 July 2008 with classified military payload. The 2.1B, Saint version is sometimes called Soyuz Street B. The first launch, from Guiana, was a success the 21st of October 2011, for the first two Galileo IOV satellites. Topic. Soyuz 2, 1V The first flight vehicle of the 2.1V version was finished in 2009. It is a light version of the Soyuz 2 without the side boosters blocks B, V, G and D. The Block A engine was replaced by the more powerful NK33-1, which as of 2009, was to eventually be replaced with the Rode 193. The new launcher version was able to deliver up to 2.8 tons in low Earth orbit.
Topic: <laughs> Modifications for various launch sites. The Soyuz 2, 1A, 1B versions launched from the Vostokny Cosmodrome and the Guiana Space Center have a series of modifications over the stock units. Some of these might later be implemented on all the Soyuz 2, while some are particular requirements to the spaceport design. Modifications for the Guiana Space Center GSC version includes First use of a mobile service tower at the ELS that enabled vertical payload integration. European supplied payload adapters. European supplied KSE French, Kit de Sauvegarde Européenne, lit. European Safeguard Kit, a system to locate and transmit a flight termination signal. It would activate the engine shutdown command and leave the vehicle in a ballistic trajectory. Adaptation of the S-band telemetry system on all stages from the five trademark bands available at Baikonur, and Plesisk to the three allowed at the GSC range. Adaptation of the S-band telemetry coding and frequency to the IRIG standard used at GSC. Adaptation of the oxygen purge system for directing to the outside the mobile gantry. Adaptation to the tropical GSC climate including the adaptation of the air conditioning system to local specifications and protective measures to avoid icing. All holes and cavities were studied and certified to be adequately protected against intrusion of insects and rodent. The four boosters and the core stage were upgraded with pyrotechnic devices to breach the fuel tanks to assure that they would sink in the ocean. The other stages were shown to lose structural integrity on impact and thus proven to sink. At least initially, the boosters and core stage would use the pyrotechnically ignited 14D22 RD107A and 14D23 RD108A rather than the chemically ignited 14D22 KHZ and 14D23 KHZ used on the rest of the Soyuz 2. Modifications for the Vostokny Cosmodrome version includes New and upgraded computer, NA Semikatov NPO Automaticus Malachite 7, with six times more performance, better obsolescence protection, reduced weight. The new computer enabled a significant reduction on the cable network complexity thanks to multiplexing lines and using common buses. New nickel-cadmium batteries that eliminate the need for a dedicated battery charging station. The inclusion of onboard video system, that will enable real-time views of the launch. Since the launch pad at Vostokny also has a mobile gantry for vertical payload integration, similar to the ELS at Guiana, it has the necessary piping to direct the oxygen purges outside the gantry. On 1 October 2015 it was announced that parts of the assembly complex for the Soyuz 2 at Vostokny Cosmodrome were designed for a different modification of the rocket and are too small, so that the planned first launch in December 2015 was under question. The first launch occurred on 28 April 2016 at 2 hours 1 minute and 21 seconds Coordinated Universal Time. Notable missions Suborbital test flight On 8 November 2004, at 18.30 Greenwich Mean Time, 21.30 Moscow Time, the first Soyuz 2 carrier rocket, in the Soyuz 2-1A configuration, was launched from the Plesetsk Cosmodrome in Russia. The rocket followed a suborbital trajectory, with the third stage and boilerplate payload re-entering over the Pacific Ocean. <laughs> Maiden launch The first attempt at launching a Soyuz 2 to orbit, with the METOP-A satellite, occurred on 17 July 2006. It was scrubbed two hours before the launch by an automatic sequence, after the onboard computer failed to check the launch azimuth. Fueling of the rocket was underway at the time, and all launch complex equipment and onboard preliminary checks had proceeded without incident. The rocket was left fueled on the launch pad, for the next attempt on 18 July. Launch was eventually conducted on 19 October. Topic. Launch statistics Soyuz 2 rockets have accumulated 82 launches since 2006, 75 of which were successful, yielding a 91.5% success rate. Topic. List of launches Topic. Planned launches Topic. See also 
Soyuz program equals equals notes